Um, I just say I was locked in and focused on, you know, whatever my coach wanted me to do. Uh, that's what executing, uh, using my leg, uh, putting the ball in there, hitting your targets. I just came out and just stayed locked in, stayed focused on what I supposed to do, uh, when I supposed to do it. Did you feel like you were on each time? Uh, yes, I gave it my all. Uh, way before we even went out, you know, guys were saying, uh, you know, empty your bucket. You know, just go out there and put it all on the line. And, you know, that's the only thing that was going in my mind, just, you know, put it on the line for them guys. Whatever you have to do, just do it. Well, that, how did you describe the team you just put out? I mean, you just torched that defense. I mean, um, you know, I just, I say I just was mentally locked in, mentally focused. Um, that's the game you'll want to see in a quarterback, a guy that's just out there giving his all, a guy that's just doing whatever it takes to keep the chains moving and just put points on the board. Did you go up to uh, Mitch after the game and console him in any way? No, no, not at all. Uh, I just told Mitch, you know, things happen. You know, at the end of the day, you got to keep your head up. Um, you know, I love each and every one of them guys. Uh, you know, I go to battle any day with them guys. Uh, I told Mitch, you know, there's nothing we could do about that. It happened for a reason. Um, I know what you were trying to do, and the coaches know what you were trying to do. You were just trying to fight for extra yards, but at the end of the day, there's nothing we could do about that. How difficult is it considering the expectations for this season and now it's your rival each year after it's accomplished anything? Um... You know, I can just say big up to them guys. Uh, them guys came out, they played today too. Uh, both sides of the ball, you know, we played and they played. Um, made the best man win and just, it was their night tonight. How would you describe the, se the season you wrapped up last um, I would say it was good. Uh, it was a great season. Uh, you know, it, it didn't go how a lot of people wanted to go about us putting up points. The only thing we cared about was the win. Uh, as long as we come away with the win and, you know, live to see another day, another Another game. Are you disappointed you're not going to play for a championship? Uh, yes, I am. Uh, you know, because the championship is on my birthday. Uh, it's not my. It's nothing I can do about it. You know, I just went out there and played my all. I gave my all. You know, this team gave it his all, and you know, them guys just, you know, they kept fighting, they kept playing. Quentin, how did Darnell get so open on that touchdown? What happened? Um, I'll say I, we had a Mitch match there, uh, a linebacker on the receiver, and I knew Darnell could run. Um, and I knew that linebacker wanted to keep up with Darnell. I just gave Darnell a chance to get up under the ball, and he came away with it. Did you play action there? Uh, no, not at all. Is this the best game you've ever played personally? Um, yes. Yes, uh, with, uh, I'll say what, like four something in the air. Mm -hmm. um, you know, that's the most you know, I ever threw in the game. Mm -hmm. um, you know, it gets no better than that. When you been playing in this team, was this everything it should be, the rivalry game? Uh, we didn't run no trick plays. We ran our normal offense. Um, it just tonight wasn't our night. But I mean, as far as playing in a rivalry game, was it the atmosphere? Was it uh, yes, uh, it was a good at atmosphere. Um, just knowing that you know it was a packed stadium. Uh, this is what you prepared for. This is what you wanted to be under. Uh, you wanted to show your talent in front of the world, and you know that's what I did tonight. That's what we did tonight. When you Um, you no, know, before you make your decision, just get on your knees and pray. Uh, just tell God to lead you in the right direction. And, you know, God led me to USF, and I want to be a different maker. And, you know, never give up on your dream. Uh, if you feel that you're a quarterback and you want to play quarterback, just be that guy. Um, go in and uh, work hard, um, study film, and don't let nobody else tell you different. Did you talk to Kennedy after the game? Oh, uh, yes. What did you say to him? Um, I just told him, you know, the sky's the limit for him. Um, you know, just keep going out there, keep working. Uh, it was a great game between both of us. Um, you know, he's a young guy, and a lot of people will tell you a lot of things. You just got to stay focused and do what's best for you and your team. Quinn, how much did that end of the first half pick by you hurt your team? Because it looked like you guys could have taken the momentum just instead of taking the lead heading into halftime. How much of that was you? Um, I'd say it was a bad decision by me. Uh, I should have just, you know, tucked it and ran it. Uh, you know, live to see another down. I tried to make a play and it didn't come out how I wanted it, but can't do nothing about it. When you look back at this game 10, 20 years from now, what will you remember about it? Uh, I remember that I just went out and played my heart. I gave it my all, uh, every play, every down, no matter what defense they were playing, no matter what coverage they were playing, no matter, you know, if a guy was uncovered and he blitzing. 
Mm -hmm. I just gave him my all. Just keep the change moving. Thank you. <laughs> no problem.